Today, Apple took the spotlight in the tech news sphere for several reasons, highlighting its stock potential, upcoming earnings report, and insights from top analysts amid the backdrop of challenges and opportunities it's facing, especially in the Chinese market. First off, Apple investors have had a roller coaster year with sales witnessing year over year declines for four consecutive quarters before seeing an uptick. But here's a splash of optimism. A Wall Street analyst from Wedbush, Dan Ives, is casting a sunny forecast on Apple's future. Despite acknowledging a looming soft period, Ives sees a silver lining with the anticipated demand for a yet theoretical AI driven iPhone 16 model. Ives is betting big on Apple with a reaffirmed price target of $250, which would mark about a 47% leap from Tuesday's closing price. On the earnings front, Apple is poised to release its financial results for the second fiscal quarter. All eyes are on the tech giant, with analysts and investors setting the bar low, hoping Apple can surpass the muted expectations. The focus sharpens on iPhone sales and Apple's performance in China, a critical market that's been a tough nut to crack recently due to declined sales and the Chinese government's apparent cooling towards foreign tech, including Apple's iPhones. Amidst these challenges, Apple grapples with the intensified competition from domestic brands like Huawei, which continues to gain momentum despite U.S. export controls. Adding to the intrigue, Apple recently acknowledged a glitch with iPhone alarms not sounding off, an issue that has stirred discussions on social media platforms. This minor hiccup, however, pales in comparison to the broader strategic challenges and opportunities Apple faces, particularly in navigating its standing in the Chinese market and reinforcing its product appeal globally. As we edge closer to the release of the earnings report, there's a palpable mix of apprehension and cautious optimism. Analysts are revising forecasts and the investment community is keenly watching for signs of resilience or breakthrough in Apple's strategy, especially regarding its capital return plans and projections for the coming quarter. Now, I want to hear from you. What do you think about Apple's stock potential and its strategy amidst the challenges it faces, especially in China? Are you optimistic about the rumored iPhone 16 and its AI-driven capabilities? Drop your thoughts, insights, and any questions you might have in the comments below. Let's keep the conversation going on what's next for Apple in this ever-evolving tech landscape. Thanks for watching to the end. Remember, this is just one story from our full daily show, which includes all the other news and an analysis of the day's tech market activity. If you found this video interesting or insightful, then please like, subscribe, and share it with others. Your support is greatly appreciated. Catch you later.